My name is Julia McGrath and we are live at the UK Games Expo. Who said gaming was boring? People here are nuts. Let's go check it out. the NEC with the UK Games Expo convention. Uh, we've been extremely busy all morning, people visiting the stand wanting to demo the New Earth game. We've had quite a few people buy it after playing it, which is great to see. We have some really good uh, feedback from people, they do enjoy the game. So it's quite rewarding to see that. It's, uh, nothing's better than the experience of being here to see it live. It's fantastic, it's great to see a uh, great demand for people wanting to demo New Earth. It's so cool, I love it, it's really, really cool, yeah. I especially like when you get to bargain over getting new places and new territories and I've kind of scammed him out of a couple, <laughs> but... <laughs> Economic style games, I like the way that you've got to kind of like keep your balance between the consumer goods and the money and the different resources you're trying to pick up. I quite like the um, trading of it, yeah. so... Um, yeah, like the processes of um, getting materials and, and then converting them into money and other stuff like that. We've also, of course, on the stand got uh, Ludo Arte Cafe here to remind people of the Ludrati Cafe franchise that we're trying to expand the stores and we've had quite a bit of interest as well on that so people at least have begun to realise it's here and so that's also very good because we know that there are I think around 10,000 people that visit the, the, the conference today so there's a, a lot of exposure for us in the right way. I think most people have been very pleased to hear that someone is finally trying to take this nationwide there's a lot of independent places popping up, but it's nice to see that there's a premier board game cafe out there which is appealing to everyone, not just gaming communities. Great idea, yeah. I think it's a wonderful idea, yeah. Yeah, yeah it yeah. sounds like a good it's date night, to be honest. <laughs> it is about inclusion, and you have to talk and communicate with other people. That's obviously the advantage to, like, cafes. You have to socialise with people out of your comfort zone, yeah. which kids don't tend to do nowadays, because you can stay at home and play in front of a computer rather yeah. than meet someone. Board games require you to meet up with someone. But with a board game you put it down and you'll get people to come around and, and start looking at it. What's that? Can I have a go? Yeah, well that looks rubbish. You know, you, yeah. But it, it's all interaction and it's, you know, it, it leads on to so many other things. It's great to see people's involvement with the event, really getting involved and turning up, dressing up. Unfortunately, I wasn't allowed to dress up myself, so I have to just come in my normal uniform. That's a massive shame. I know, I think I would make a great Zelda. <laughs> well, it has been a really tiring day at the Gaming Expo, but it's been brilliant. I dressed up as a fairy, I got attacked by a Dalek, and I rode a sheep. Please check out our website that's coming up next. Go to Ludorati Cafe. Cafe.